Hello everyone, this is Thomas Kincaid. My new painting, as you can see, features a fly fisherman. Now this is the first time I have portrayed a subject of a fisherman as being central to one of my paintings. Now picture this setting. This is a stream coming out of the mountains. The morning mist is rising. You have sunlight pouring through. Flowers are springing up everywhere. The rocks are covered with moss. And it's a tranquil, perfect morning. Now this is the first painting in a brand new series. And I hope to add other settings similar to this with the idea of celebrating the joy of fishing. Of course, when I picture my fishermen here along the stream, I'm reminded of some of the camp settings that I've painted in the past. I love the sense of humble, primitive dwellings that are standing in the midst of vastness where you might really savor the grandeur of God's creation. I love to paint a cabin in the woods with the light just pouring through the woods, but I also love the idea of sunset over the mountain ranges. I remember my recent painting, which was entitled Evening Majesty. What a sense of a perfect life, a perfect place to dwell in harmony with nature. Of course, many times an artist gets inspiration from memories. And though the occasions were few, I will never forget the times I spent with my father searching the woods for the perfect fishing spot I don't think we ever found a place quite this beautiful, but we always looked for the perfect spot to fish. Now for those of you who've never sat beside a stream and attempted to lure a brook trout onto your line, I have good news for you. This painting has very little to do with the art of angling and has everything to do with the art of celebrating nature. Now one of the things I love about being a plein air painter is that it gives me an excuse to be settled for two hours at a time and just absorb the beauty of nature. Many of the times uh, that I've had that are most meaningful to me in the outdoors have been with my easel set up in a mountain glade or perhaps beside a raging waterfall. Uh, in fact, I've been on horseback oftentimes seeking the deepest parts of the forest now these beautiful settings, often awe-inspiring settings, are what really inspire all my nature subjects. And whether it's a mountain cabin beside a stream, or perhaps a beautiful lakeside setting at sunset, every painting that I create is really an extension of some of my deepest, most intimate experiences with nature. What an excuse to be in God's creation and just bask in the joy of his natural world. The centerpiece of the setting is the trout pool, the deep color of rich blues and greens that celebrate the depths of a cool crystal stream as it slows and creates a pool. And these pools are just where trout love to hide out and bask in the sunshine as it pours through the trees. And of course, here we see sun rays of morning light just pouring through the branches of the trees. There's a sense of mist rising off the waterfalls that we see in the distance. And of course, I had the idea that mist was shrouding the scene. This mistiness suggests that this fisherman knew enough to come out early in search of the perfect trout. I love the effects of dappled light. And of course, in a forest, you always have light hitting patches of the ground. And we see the light on the branches of the tree, but also sprinkling itself like giant raindrops across the foreground. I love the details of a river. We have the rocks covered with moss. We have the sense of foliage that overhangs the water and is reflected. And of course, the tree trunk, which has fallen into the stream itself, a perfect place to set yourself up for a day of fishing. Now this painting is quite a departure for me because rarely have I featured a human figure so prominent. And yet there's something about the angler with his wading boots and his creel and his vest and of course his pole in hand uh, that really to me looks in, right in keeping with nature. Of course what could be more serene than a fisherman a busy at work on a stream in the morning light. 
Of course, you may never have held a fishing pole in your hand in your entire life, but I think all of us dream of sneaking off into the woods and communing with God's creation. Now, my hope is that even if you can't go out and try your luck at a fishing hole, that this painting throughout the year will bring a little of the beauty and serenity of the woods right into your home. Now, as always, this is Thomas Kincaid thanking you so much for your support. Uh, you know, these paintings are a ministry. It's a ministry of light and hope that goes into each and every home. Uh, we like to think that a painting is an invited guest into the home, that we can set up our abode with you in your home and hopefully bring a little of God's love and the beauty of His creation into your life every day. God bless you and thanks for sharing the light.